the ongoing rollout of various platforms of digital related transactions is setting top priority for the detailed implementation and monitoring of the national payment system according to Bank of Uganda. The electronic transactions shot up considerably during the year that ended in June 2020. Mobile money transactions grew by 19.3 to nearly 80 trillion shillings, of which nearly 41 billion was recorded in the half starting January to June 2020. Also important to note is that the escrow account balances increased by about 51.8% from Uganda shillings, 623 billion in June 2019 to about 960 billion in June 2020. Experts on financial inclusion matters argue that strengthening integrity of digital financial solutions remains of importance for industry players in view of global integration. Regulators are increasingly worried and so are most financial sector players on the fact that fraud and security risks are getting increasingly sophisticated. One of the pieces that as an industry we should be talking about is shared infrastructure. Can we reduce the cost of complex uh, infrastructure like cybersecurity? So it is, it is a significant cost that we really, really have to look into. And there are other ways to achieve what the regulator is trying to achieve. A regulator, and rightly so, would like to be able to, to view what's going on to audit what's going on in each data system, make sure it's okay and it's up to standard. This meeting in Kampala today that brought together Bank of Uganda, Ministry of Finance and Financial Institutions, among others, had discussions centered on the national payment system. Banks and financial institutions have been, have been investing heavily over time in digital capability. And the benefit of that is becoming much more real now as there's increased sensitization of the public about uh, the value uh, of utilization of digital out of convenience, etc. Reina Ojun, NTV Business.